Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is Carmine Sabia with Explain America and the Lakin Riley's mother. She's responded to President Joe Biden saying her daughter's name and saying it incorrectly at the State of the Union. Before we get started, please make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Those little things really help us out and they help our channel continue to grow. Lakin Riley's demise at the hands of an illegal immigrant is a horrible, horrible, tragic 2024 story. When the election comes around, I pray that people don't forget her. I pray that people remember her. Remember her and think about your own children and what you want to do to prevent this from happening to your child, to your grandchild, to someone else's child. American citizens. I see it all the time. Saw a video today. Flood victims in San Diego being booted out of a hotel. They're flood victims. They didn't ask to be placed in a hotel. They were placed in the hotel by the county because they're victims of a flood. Nothing of their own doing. They didn't do anything wrong. And they're being kicked out of that hotel. So illegal immigrants can come in. They did do something wrong. They broke the law. Flood victims didn't break the law. We are kicking out American citizens who have been through a tragedy to house people who broke our laws. Only in America. It's absolutely ridiculous. And everybody who voted and continues to vote for this disaster should be ashamed of themselves. Well, Lakin Riley's mother had enough. Someone posted to her on Facebook, you know, Joe Biden mentioned your daughter's name and he got it wrong. He said Lincoln Riley. And she said it was pathetic. She called him pathetic. And she said, if you're going to say my daughter's name, even when you're forced to, because he was forced to by Marjorie Taylor Greene, make no mistake about it. She said, even when you're forced to, get it right. Her name's been all over the news. You decrepit old man. You decrepit, memory lost, uncaring about anything but your own power, old man. You couldn't remember her name. Well, I'm going to tell you this, Mr. President. I'm going to remember her name. Millions of Americans are going to remember her name. And they're going to remember it when they march to the voting booth or when they do their early mail-in voting or their drop box voting, because we're going to utilize those tools too. We're going to utilize them too. Make no mistake. We're going to remember it when we vote. We're going to say her name. And then we're going to say goodbye to you as president. I want to know what you guys think about this. Please let me know in the comments. Please, as always, like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'm Carmine Sabia for Explain America. We love you guys. God bless you. Take care, everybody.